So, what do you, honest opinion, what do you reckon of Max peating rods? Like, I mean, it hasn't to be blown honest, up I'm, on me yet, and I've been huh? fucking sending it for a week. Yeah? Yeah, it hasn't blown up on me yet, so. Thank goodness for that. It worked out pretty well. But yeah, so this is a Max Peating Rods turbocharger. Um, I believe this is the TDO 520G. Just get you move your hands there. So it's 25, TDO 520G, so they're meant to be the upgraded rear housing ones, aren't they? They're meant to be able to put out approximately 400 horsepower when tuned. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Today would be nice day. Today. T -t -t Today. So what do we got here? We got some gaskets. Metal gaskets. We got some bags. Some more bags. Ah, oh, and we got a turbo. Hmm. Oh, that's quite small. It is quite small. That is cute. Show us the Supra. <laughs> Yeah, so this is the Max Peating Rods Turbo. Um, I'm not really sure what to comment on it. It's very small. Compact. compact. But you know what, it's probably bigger than your current yeah, turbo though. Stock. Yeah, the stock is a lot smaller than that. So uh, we're just checking for shaft play, Derek. Pretty good. Pretty good? Has it, has it been uh, has it been um, balanced as well? Is there any shavings on the blades? Yes. Yeah, so show the any front, balancing? It's been balanced. Oh look, so they balanced the front front as well, which is pretty good. The rears are usually not really required. Yeah, but it's been balanced too. Normally they um. That's been balanced as well. Yeah, it's been balanced in the rear too. Yeah. Ah, oh, so they've balanced the. Is it on the nut? They yeah. normally balance on yeah. the nut. Yeah. 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 It's on the side uh, there. Uh, move your hand. Get your hand out of the way. Anyways, so it's been balanced. That's all we need to know. It's really small. Stop calling it small. It's about how you use it. True, that's true. Sorry guys, I only know how to compare it to Super Turbos. <laughs> <laughs> so I love this. <laughs> but overall this turbo actually looks pretty decent. Um, I don't know, I guess we gotta test it and see how it goes when it's in the car. Um, Cyrus will be able to tell us how it compares as well. If it doesn't rattle, it's good. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, so his current turbo rattles off its head like crazy, like crazy, crazy, so. The wastegates failed there. Yeah, the wastegates failed. So uh, let's, uh, let's get this uh, show on the road and uh, swap the turbo out. Mm. In short, over here is the turbo. We're probably gonna have to take off this thing here. Um, the heat shield down here, there'll be a couple bolts holding it on the flange over there. And it should be a direct bolt in. Everything's pretty standardized on the Subarus. So you can cross, um, cross use a lot of the turbos and things like that that are already in Subarus. Which is really good so you can upgrade to VFs and not have to change too much. And then there'll be an oil drain below the turbo which is an absolute pickle to get to. Um, when putting the new turbo back on. Um, but should be a pretty uh, standardized, easy thing to do. I mean, I'm not doing it. We're just going to watch Derek do it. Um, yeah, Derek loves doing shit for us. And while Derek's doing that, these guys are going to be installing the coilovers as well. So we put a pair in Derek's car. Um, Cyrus really liked it, and so now he's put a pair in his car. Don't forget, guys, you can get a 15% discount code off me. Just use my name in the coupon bit, which is... Pretty good. I mean, who doesn't like discounts? I don't get anything out of it, so. But I hope you guys get something out of it. Popper. So guys, we're currently taking off the uh, dump pipe. Um, well, they are. So Campbell over here and Mr. Derek. Um, reason, reason, reason being why I'm not helping too much is because I'm a little bit too hungover. Um, I enjoyed, I enjoyed my I enjoyed my nights out, and so I enjoyed last night too much, and I'm pretty much paralyzed. So all I am good for today is being cameraman. Yeah. But yeah, no, they're doing a fantastic job. Oh, listen to that clang! My goodness, they're proper on tight. Oh, hopefully you don't break any. <laughs> no jinxing. Next minute. <laughs> yeah, next minute. <laughs>
bad, you know? <laughs> Have it done. You better uh, put some copper grease on them. Yeah. I got them over there. So it's pretty much uh, intercooler out, turbo heat shield off, and then dump pipe off, and, then and the intake, pipe. intake pipe. And then the up pipe is the hard one. Oh, that one there, this yeah. pipe here. Yeah. Up pipe, no, the up pipe. What up pipe? Yeah, What's an up pipe? I only know what a down pipe is. You know the head. <laughs> so up pipe, the Subaru has the headers, and then the headers go up into the up pipe that goes into the turbo, and then they're back to the down pipe. Oh, yeah, 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 the four bolts there. Yeah, and they're up. So, uh, you should have said T flange. That's oh, they're not even a T flange, are they? Yeah, they're not a flange. Is that a stud or? Uh, there's one more at the bottom. So guys, I had a blonde moment. I know what an up pipe is. <laughs> What's up dog? What's up dog? What's up dog? So guys, here's the uh, crusty old dump pipe that's now come out. Good work guys. I've, I've just, uh, as mentioned before, I've just put a seat down. I'm literally just watching them. Yeah, no, I'm being super comfortable. <laughs> Okay guys, that's really fantastic. Um, I was doing some supervising and I did a really good job of supervising and now the turbo's out so props, huge effort to me. Thank you guys for not doing anything and me doing all the supervising. <laughs> nah, just jokes. Anyways, uh, so this is the comparison between the two different turbos. Um, so as you can see here, the front housing is a lot a lot, lot bigger. Uh, this one's a lot smaller. Um, way bigger. In terms of the ID, OD of the impeller blades, there's a fair bit of a difference too, so, uh, compared to the stock. And this turbo is actually cheap as chips as well, compared to, well, I mean, just cheap as chips as an upgrade. Um, rear housing looks marginally a bit bigger, but we haven't really measured up any of the blades, so we can't really give you an exact. That's look, that, that actually looks like a proper sized upgrade. That's a fucking way bigger. <laughs> yeah, that's a proper sized upgrade. That's a TDF4, that's a TDF5. That's what I was running. The so turbo that we're putting on now is probably worth about $200. Um, they gave me a discount on it. As again, you can use the code, 15% off. Um, I can't wait to see the results, Cyrus, and uh, see your first drive as well once we put it back on. I can't wait to do that. It's going to be fantastic. Yeah. Mr. Big Boy Cyrus. We finally get to see your reaction after you've been dodging me for a week. Bro, I've just been having fun. What else am I supposed to do? <laughs> Too much fun, bro. Start it up, let's go. Send it. Oof. He's gonna full send. Oofed. Oofed. Alright, you ready? Alright, let's go full send. Oh, oh shit, that's not bad. <laughs> <laughs> that's not bad. That's not bad. <laughs> oh, fuck it. Never gets old. Never gets old. So, what do you, honest opinion, what do you reckon of max peating rods? Like, I mean, it hasn't to be blown honest, on me yet. I've been mean, huh? fucking sending it for a week. Yeah? Yeah, it hasn't blown up on me yet, so... Thank goodness for that. Worked out pretty well. Hey, on your Cyrus. Fuck. Having too much fun. Pretty sure I'm hearing Uncle Rodney there. <laughs> Rodney, yeah. <laughs> Rodney's just gone knock, 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 knock. <laughs> oh, well. Ah, oh, she's good. Works That's well. Fantastic. It's a bigger turbo. Fucking fuel efficiency back up there from being basically NA. Couldn't ask for more. Nice. Overall, uh, I feel like the TDO 520G um, was a significant upgrade. It's a significant upgrade. 
Um, so compared to the TD-04, um, which is stock standard, it spooled up really quick, but you felt the top end die out. But as you move to the TD-05 20G, you really felt that extra, you know, punch. Um, but those turbos are rated to 400 horsepower. So it's a lot more horsepower than what the TD-04s are rated to. Uh, in a proper recommendation, I'd recommend something a little bit smaller than TD-0520G. Uh, that is the turbo that John has as well. Uh, but by all means, it's a very cheap upgrade and it's something that will be better than the TD-04. But honestly, I'd recommend a VF-34 above all else. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, it was really an calming and relaxing listening to all that music. Um, soothes the soul. Anyways, guys, see you later.